to stop it? Oh, I can't stop it. Yeah. Here. No, no, no. I, I, that would be like somebody stopping. What's well, so, the, it's a bit of a visor. When <coughs> she may not be able to stop it. We might be able to make it leave, though. Yes. In other words, cast cast out was over there. We might take Father Jim with us and mm -hmm. do a casting out, mm -hmm. almost like a mini exorcism. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, we can't yeah, we perform an that. exorcism. No. A priest can. A priest could. <clears throat> but in other words, she can't just walk in and say, okay, I want all this stuff to stop. Sometimes it works when you try to mm -hmm. cast out and tell them to leave in the name of Jesus Christ and go back to where you came from. And sometimes it really doesn't work, depending on how strong it is. Mm -hmm. But the thing about Lorraine's ability is, she'll tell you right now, she doesn't know where it comes from or what it is even. She'll say it's like there's two separate people. But she can't even relate to the second no. psychic person. No, I don't know that person. I, I, I know the person I am right now with you, but I don't know that other person at all. I don't have, and I, I don't I don't even associate in that way about the psychic ability. Or like, like say, um, I go around and try to read your auras. I can read your auras, but I, I don't do that. Anybody yeah. here have psychic ability beyond what you know a normal kind of or think they're psychic to a degree? No? I think really? somebody comes and goes. It's not consistent. Yeah. Mm, okay. I think we all have a little bit yeah, of something, but I, mean, yeah, I like, think you're right. If there's a way to hone in on it kind of thing. I think we all have a little bit of, like you said, that's true. Uh, how about um, if that's George Clooney, I can't fill in for him tomorrow. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, how about anybody here ever uh, Father, James? pick it up. Probably, he's probably ordered a pizza. But, uh, anybody here ever see a ghost? Yes. Anybody here ever see a ghost? Oh, wow. Yes. Really? Oh. How about, uh, or live in a haunted house? Live in a haunted house? I live in an active house, but I don't think You don't, it's active, that was spirit? Yeah, it's active, but they're all positive, so I don't call it haunting. I just you? call it visitors, not good, ghosts. Good, good for you. Good day, yeah. Yeah, I, I remember I remember this one night Ed and I were getting to bed and we have can I've always had canopy beds. And Ed, you know, Ed, Ed never liked the canopy beds, but we always had them. So anyway, this we were Ed was asleep and he, he tur turned over on the side and he fell asleep right away. And I said, Honey, 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 look at Look what's coming under the canopy. Look at the ghost that's coming under the canopy. Honey! I'm, I'm trying to wake him up. God damn it, get the hell out of here. The thing, it, it, it's like shot. Ow. Yeah. Didn't come back either. We got, we'll tell, I'll tell him one more quick story. we got to get to the videos, okay? Uh, one time they, were, they did a lecture and they were staying in a little hotel. Very nice, old haunted hotel. So they, were, they had, they had uh, actually had a little full-size bed, you know. So they're laying down. All of a sudden, and the lights are off. All of a sudden, Lorraine can feel she was she's ghost? getting tucked in. Somebody's tucking her in, right? <laughs> she, goes, she goes like this. Hey, yeah, thanks for tucking me in. That was nice. That was very sweet of you. So, no answer. Ed, thanks for tucking me in. That was very sweet of you, honey. Nothing. She flicks the light under the thing, looks over, he's sound asleep. Oh, Something was stuck in there, wasn't there. But, but, yeah, but, but, the, but the, the hands, the finger, fingers went like all down my back, you know, and then uh, around, around my neck, because it was cold in that house, and uh, all around my neck, and it, it, really, it had to be a spirit. But it was in England. So the place is loaded. <laughs> you spend a lot of time there. The internet says that the Warrens have done about 10,000 cases, investigations. Probably, is probably, that about right? That's probably an overestimation. It's, yeah. I'd say more like five or six. Yeah. I remember, they've wow. been doing it since, since Ed was like, a, just got out of the Navy. Yes. 19 years old, 19 years old. He was starting to investigate haunted homes. Well, at what point did he become interested in when he lived in one? The in demonology, the, he, because if he didn't yeah. well, really like the that ties in clairvoyant wife. That, no, but that, that, yeah. that ties in. You got to remember, yeah. he grew up in a haunted house when he was five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve yeah. years old.